Hello everyone. Our today's topic is how you can convert binary number to hexadecimal and hexadecimal to binary. So we'll start with the binary number that is given that is in ones and zeros and we have to convert it into hexadecimal that is in the base 16 and this is in the base 2. So its first step is you have to do a grouping of four bits. Bits means binary digits. One one binary digit is called a bit. So they, we have to make the grouping of four bits from right to left. So like this, like this. So this is the grouping of four bits from right to left. I have uh, draw, drawn an arrow just to show that this grouping is from right to left. So this is very important to keep in your mind. Then we will convert these four bits into their hexadecimal equivalent. So let's see how we can do that. So we'll start from the right to left, we will write 1, 1, 1, this is one group of digits, this uh, one, uh, uh, four group of bits. So how we can convert it into the hexadecimal, just see. First we have to label the digits from right to left as this is at location 0, this is at 1, this is at 2 and this is at 3 and we how we will write? We will write it as first we have to write this base that is 2 and its power will be this digit that is on the uh, location of the digit on the left 2 raised to power 3 multiplied by this one plus 2 raised to power this location 2 multiplied by this one plus 2 raised to power this digit multiplied by this one plus 2 raised to power this location that is 0 multiplied by 1. So what we will get is we will get it, it is equals to 15 and 15 and in hexadecimal 15 is equals to F. So it will be equals to F. So this is equals to F. 1 1 1. So this group of bits is equals to F. Now we will take the next group of bits that is this group of bits and let's see how we can convert it. 1, 1, 0, 0 is equals to, again we have to follow the same procedure that is at location 0, 1, 2, 3. We have to multiply the 2 with the power 3 multiplied by this 1 plus 2 with the power 2 multiplied by 1 plus 2 with the power 1 multiplied by 0 plus 2 with the, multi with the power 0 that will be 0. So what we'll get is 8, 8 plus 4 equals to 12 and in hexadecimal 12 is equals to C. Keep this in mind in hexadecimal the de uh, digits from 0 to 9 are same and then 10 is for A, 11 is for B, 12 is for C, 13 is for D, 14 is for E and 15 is for F. So here we have 12, so 12 is equals to C. Now we will take another group of 4 bits that is 0 1 0 1 0 1 0 1 and we will convert it as again the same similar way this is at location 0 1 2 3 and take 2 2 th to the power 3 multiplied by this digit 0 plus 2 to the power 2 multiplied by 1 this digit plus 2 to the power 1 multiplied by 0 plus 2 to the power 0 multiplied by so what we will get is 0 plus 4 plus 0 plus 1 equals to 5 equals to 5. Now lastly the last group of bits that is 1 1 0 1 1 1 0 1 and it will again have the same procedure to convert in hexadecimal equi equivalent. So what we will get is 2 raised to power 3 into 1 plus 2 raised to power 2 into 1 plus 2 raised to power 1 into 0 plus 2 raised to power 0 into 1. What we will get is, we will get 13. And in, in hexadecimal, 13 is equals to D. So we have got the hexadecimal equivalent of this uh, uh, binary number that is D, 5, C, F. So this is the hexadecimal equivalent of the given number. So this is how you can convert binary to hexadecimal. Now we will see how you can convert an, a hexadecimal to binary number. So here we have an example. Now we will convert the hexadecimal number to the binary. 
So here I have taken the example of the same data we I have uh, converted from binary to hexadecimal. So we can easily uh, verify that the answer is true or not. So D5 CF16. So what we ha we have to do first we have to convert the uh, these hexadecimal to the their decimal equivalent. So how uh, we can do that? Let's see. First we have to write that in decimal D is for 13, 5 is for 5, C is for 12 and F is for 15. Now we will convert these decimal numbers into their binary equivalent. So we can easily do this by doing a repeated division. Let's see how. Now it's 13 and as we have to convert in the de uh, into the binary, so we have to divide by 2. So it's 13, 2, 6 are 12. Remainder is 1, 2 3s are 6, remainder is 0 and 2 1s are 2, remainder is 1. So the binary equivalent will be like this. We will start from here and if I write here what will be the binary equivalent of 13, it will be 1 1 0 1. Similarly, we can find the binary equivalent of 5 as 2 2s are 4, remainder is 1. 2 1s are 2 remainder is 0. So here again we have to go like this and what we will get is the binary equivalent of 5 and keep this in mind it should be 4 digit. It should be 4 digit. So as it is written here 1 0 1. So to make it 4 we have to add 0 here. So this is the binary equivalent of 5. Then we have a 12. How we can do that? We can convert the 12 here as 2 6 are 12 remainder is 0 2 3s are 6 remainder is 0 and 2 1s are 2 remainder is 1 and we have to go from here like this so what we will get we will get 1 1 0 0 this is the binary equivalent of 12 then the binary equivalent of 15 will be 2 7s are 14 1 3s are 6 1 2 1s are 2 1 so we will go from here like this and what we will get is 1 1 1 1. This is the binary equivalent of 15. So we have got the binary equivalent of all the four um, hexadecimal digits and uh, we can combine then we will combine it and we will get the required conversion. As so what we will do we will replace D by 1 1 0 1 then 5 by this 0 1 0 1 then C by 1 1 0 0 and then F by 4 ones 1 1 1 1 so this is the binary equivalent of the given hexadecimal number so this is how we can convert the binary to hexadecimal and hexadecimal to binary so that's all from today's lecture thank you